Brushes and Banjos is an event where three to four hundred artists and art lovers are invited to connect, make friends, and spark something fresh in Denver's art scene. I am showing people my artwork and selling greeting cards and enjoying the party <laughs> music. I'm a pet photographer. I photograph pets, dogs, and cats. It was something I always wanted to do. Um, I painted when I was a kid, so when I was able to give up uh, accounting, um, I jumped right into painting and haven't looked back. I got you right here with a Denver Pale Ale. I am plein air painting a uh, floral today, actually, in oils. I paint a lot of nature subjects, flowers and birds and landscapes. There's nothing like uh, being outdoors for the color inspiration. I just do what I like. It's all things that I wanted to make for myself, and I just share it with the world and keep going. try to have a lot of fun. We're the Virginia Dale Polecats. I love the shapes. I think they have a lot of character. I think a lot of people relate to the history. It seems like everybody has an old truck in the family that they remember from their parent or grandparent. And I paint with credit cards. There's a, it gives me a, a little bit of a different texture and I do a lot of layering so I get a variety of undertones and uh, get, uh, I think, a more unique look than I do with a brush. We're in the garden and it's just all these flowers. Somebody came by and wanted it. It was really fun to sell it to somebody that just fresh off the easel, still wet. <laughs> so it's it good. Yellow flowers. Currently, I'm painting these flowers right over here and just hanging out with other artists and collectors. Painted all my life, you know, or drawn and painted, but just never really able to try it out. And paint just full time. And this is what I'm trying to do now with the day job. <laughs> just didn't feel like it was a very creative outlet anymore. It's just awesome. It's awesome to be able to paint everything. It's been great.